says, fish swim, lobsters crawl, jellyfish float, and coral grows. It's just another day in ocean land. Or is it? much worse than I thought, Scuba Man. Uh, I scanned the entire world, and the deception scanner is going berserk. Look at these readings. Lying, counterfeiting, dishonesty, this evil, it's everywhere. It's not surprising, Snorkel Boy. The Master Deceiver and his evil minions have been working overtime since that first deception in the Garden of Eden. Kind of reminds me of what it must have been like in the days of Noah. Before the flood, when everyone's thoughts were only evil continually. It makes me shudder to think about it. Yeah, that was a wicked world, all right. Except for Noah, of course, the only person on Earth who still loved God. Which makes me thankful for the Bible. What a gift to have, the Word with us all this time. So, with God's help, we can know how to talk with God, like Noah did. Tis true. But sadly, many still choose to ignore God's Word and go their own way. And so we have to keep watch and be ready. Right. Well, look, something's happening at the Grand Canyon. It's our tour guide. I'll open a sound port so we can hear what he's saying. You see this layer of rock? This is estimated to be 330 million years old. And how do we know this? Very simple, because each layer has what is called an index fossil. Slither a sea serpent, Scuba Man. He's using circular reasoning. Precisely, boy wonder. They use fossils to date the rocks, and rocks to date the fossils. It's one of the enemy's most effective tricks. This millions of years deception has got the whole world in a headlock. Wait, what was that? Oh, it's just a pop-up ad. Those things are so annoying. Wait, I no, could... it could be a distress call. I've fallen and I can't get up. Your friend, Alex. I knew we shouldn't have let her wander off. But how could we find her? She could be anywhere. Wait, there's more. P.S. You can find me at Porpoise Cove, and please hurry. That's strange. How does she know how to communicate with us? Something seems fishy about this. Nevertheless, we shouldn't take any chances. To the scuba stuff? You read my mind, boy wonder. Scuba man. Can you just start calling me Snorkel Boy from now on? I mean, that boy one you think, it's kind of embarrassing. Well, all right. If that's how you feel. I didn't know you were so sensitive. I mean, Batman used it, so I just thought, uh, never mind. Come on, let's go. This is disastrous, Scuba Man. The battery's dead. Now what do we do? There's only one thing to do, Snorkel Boy. You grab the jumper cables and I'll grab the electric eel. Yes! Our plan is working! As soon as we they get that little sub of this fixed, they'll be on the way to the Popescope. And then, there's a surprise that will be waiting for them. <laughs> and that will be the end of the simple-minded superheroes. <laughs> then, we'll find Alex and rescue her from that Bible of theirs. <laughs> <laughs> It worked! Thank you, Electric Heels! To infinity and beyond! What was that? Nothing. What's in the point? To Porpoise Cove! To Porpoise Cove! Go ahead. Make the call. Hey, it's me. The two terrible twosome just left. He says to be ready. And tell them not to mess it up this time! The great white says not to mess up this time. Hey, they say not to worry. It's not me that needs to worry, it's them. I don't get worried. I get... 
hungry. <laughs> oh, I think I better stand over here. Oh, oh, we've got company. Hmm. Looks more like lunch to me. <laughs> oh, hello. I didn't know we had visitors. I'm Turtle. I'm with the welcome committee. You're new here, aren't you? Um, yeah, I just arrived from the Gulf of Mexico. Really? I've got family just off the coast of Florida. I absolutely love it up there. Ever been to SeaWorld? No, can't say I have. Well, if you ever want to go, let me know because I've got some great discount tickets. In the meantime, here is a visitor information packet. It's got info about everything to see and do in here in Oceanland, including a map, a calendar of events, and money-saving coupons. Any questions? Yeah. Where can I get something to eat? I'm starving. My, what big teeth you have. All the better to... Never mind. Uh, well... We have some excellent restaurants. What are you, uh, hungry for? How about turtle soup? Tur turtle soup? Ha <laughs> ha. Can I interest you in a little turtle sundae instead? A new creamery just opened around the corner. And it's getting great reviews. Hmm. Interesting idea. I've never had dessert first. But ice cream does sound pretty good right now. Don't go anywhere. I'll be right back. You know, I don't mean to be giving you advice, but you might want to leave before he comes back. Funny. I was just thinking the same thing. Thanks for the tip. Don't mention it. Well, hello there, Alex. Who said that? I did. Who are you? And how did you know my name? Uh, Tuttle told me. You're friends with Turtle? Um, yeah, we've been friends for, um, a long time now. You're not very convincing. Uh, you know, Alex, I'd really like to be a friend. I don't know. I've never been friends with an octopus before. And besides, I'm not sure that I can trust you. Oh, you can trust me. You know, I think I should go find Turtle. Oh no, you shouldn't do that, especially at a time like this. A time like what? Well, um, it's, it's shell inspection season, didn't you know that? Shell inspection season? Well, yes, every year at this time, all the totals in the whole world are frantically getting ready to go to a certain place far, far away to have their shells inspected. Didn't you watch Finding Nemo? Yeah. Well, where did you think all those toddles were going? Now listen, Alex. We are wasting precious time when we could be getting to know each other. What's that book you have? Oh, this? It's my Bible. Schoolman gave it to you, didn't he? Yeah, how'd you know? Oh. He gives those to everyone, says it's a guidebook or something. I don't know what the big deal is. I surely wouldn't want one if I were you. Really? Why not? Simple. You don't need it, girl. You've got common sense, don't you? Well, yeah, I guess. And if you don't know something, you can just find someone who does. Like me! I can tell you anything you need to know. You can? Absolutely. First, let me get rid of this thing for you. You know, Alex, 
I think we are going to be good friends. What's that sound? What? It couldn't be! What's wrong? Uh, you know, I I just forgot I have a, a, a manicure this afternoon and I'm late. Sorry, Alex, I'll have to do this another time. But wait, when will you come back? That was strange. Wow, now that is awesome! Oh, this? Yeah, it's a 007 GTX Turbo with power. Everything, cruise control, navigation, backup camera, everything. The whole package. Except for Wi-Fi, that was an add-on. Can you give me a ride, please, please, please? Well, I don't know, Alex. We don't usually... Alex? Are you okay? Are you hurt? Of course I'm okay. Why wouldn't I be? You had us quite worried, young lady. How did you get back from Porpoise Cove? Porpoise Cove? What are you talking about? You mean you weren't at Porpoise Cove? Wild underwater goose chase, Scuba Man. I knew there was something fishy going on. What's this? A Bible? Is this yours, Alex? Uh, yeah. Why is it on the ground? Do you realize how important this book is? It's actually the very word of God. That's right, and it contains God's plan of salvation, something you can't live without. But I got common sense and friends to help me when I need it. Great tidal wave of confusion, Scuba Man. Sounds like the enemy. If there isn't a dangerous deception going on here, my name isn't Snorkel Boy. Precisely my thought, Boy Wonder. Oops. Sorry. Well, anyway, we need to find out where this deception is coming from. Alex, I'm going to insist that you stay inside of the scuba cave until we make sense out of this. Snorkel Boy will escort you, and I will go ahead and try to find what I can find. Really? I get to see inside a scuba cave? Well, it's not exactly what you're thinking. You're in the protection chamber, but you won't have access to the inner cave. So I won't get to see all your secret stuff? Sorry. But don't worry, the protection chamber is clean and comfortable, and it comes with a deluxe continental breakfast. Gee, I can hardly wait. So how long do I have to stay in there? Only until we can detect and defuse this dangerous situation. Really, Alex, it's for your own safety. Try to understand. Come on, let's go. You know, you're right. This is no place for a kid to be running around by herself. Oh, I just noticed. My shoelace is untied. You go on ahead. I'll catch up with you in a second. Okay, but hurry. Alex? 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 Where'd she go? Great kettle of fish. She must have run away. Scuba man! Alex is gone. I can't believe I fell for that old my shoelace is untied trick. She was wearing flip flops. We can't worry about that now, boy wonder. S sorry. Uh, we've got to find Alex before someone or something else does. You go that way, I'll go this way. She couldn't have gotten very far. Will our superheroes be able to find Alex this time? Will Alex meet another sneaky scoundrel? Will Scuba Man remember to stop saying, Boy Wonder? To find out, tune in tomorrow. Same scuba time, same scuba channel.